Hi everybody, Dan here with No Games for Old Men. You saw me a couple of episodes ago run into a game-breaking bug in which I was unable to interact with Joseph after surviving the Gator Zone ambush. I waited a few days for a game patch because uh, the community manager for 505 Games had put out a, a message on Steam saying that beginning the week I'm recording this, a uh, patch would be released for a number of things. That came out on Tuesday, I believe it was Tuesday, uh, June 6th, and the patch 1.1.1, I believe it is, affected things like skill deck costs, reducing a lot of skills by one point. One of Diggs' skills got reduced by two points. Uh, it affected a couple of other things. Nothing related to the under threat mission quest bug that prevents you from interacting with Joseph. Checking on Reddit, I found a number of people who have this same issue and one player said that they were able to roll back to a previous save, play up to this point and through it, and the bug went away. So since I don't want to wait and like fall too far behind on this game, I've decided to try that. I'm hoping it works. I just spent the last hour and a half, possibly, replaying from an, my last hard save, which was before Crook's Hollow. So I had to re-sneak around all of the collectors, which went very fast this time because I knew, I knew exactly what to do. So I was in and out of that area in less than five minutes, probably. I had to redo the Spendthrift Ruins fight, which, again, I knew what to expect, so uh, it went a lot smoother this time. Uh, also, I noticed that... To tell Joseph we found his daughter cooking in a bathtub. Elvis, you okay? Yeah, hey, okay. If I can't kill my emotions, what good am I out here? I don't know. You kill enough emotions and you might turn. What? Evil? Okay, so. Uh, well, I also noticed that during the Spendthrift ruins fight they had reduced this was not mentioned in the patch notes i don't think unless i completely missed it they reduced the health of the saplings from 80 to 70. so i was actually able to use jade and glass bottles to pull saplings around and i eliminated half of the enemies on the map before um things got too hairy so you'll notice i'm in a much better place right now health wise uh, Elvis is at 112. Diggs is full at 150. And Jade is hurting a little bit, but I don't think I've got another Medipod. I do not. So we're going to have to babysit Jade a little bit. Unfortunately. Uh, so, so that's where we are. So I'm going to... I have now entered Gator Zone again. I'm going to re engage with the ambush. We're about to see it happen now. Because I have to talk to Joseph, and then the ambush happens. And once I complete that... You gotta get out of here! We'll it's see what happens. Uh, I'm just gonna record the whole thing, because I want my honest they reaction. Depending on whether the bug goes away or not. And I've just wasted however many hours. Where's he going? 
All right, here we go. Now, the last time this happened, and I don't know if it's what caused the bug or not, but I saved right before combat and then quit the game. And then I came back the following day and I played this fight and that's when I encountered the bug. No idea if that's what caused it. Who knows what causes these kinds of things. But we are going to play through this fight once more. This will be the fourth time I've done it. And this is the this is the last thing I can try was rolling back to a previous hard save to see if if that clears the bug. So okay. Now, what we don't have that we did have last time were a couple of medipods. And Jade is injured, so this might go a little bit different. However, uh, what I did do last time that worked very well <laughs> was I brought Elvis over here and I grabbed that scout and I chucked him. I used I used the uh, Miasma Storm to grab this scout. Stay here. And I chucked him over here. Gunmaster is now down to 90. He is on fire. He will die in three turns if I can do 30 points of damage to him before the Witch Doctor heals him. However, we want to try to prevent that if possible. Um, something different also now from the last time I at least the first time you saw me attempt this fight, was that Diggs was enraged at that time. I was able to use an enraged uh, tactical disc shot to kill this scout here. It worked the first time. I Diggs is not enraged right now, so I do have to do something different. So we are down to five enemies. We've got Gunmaster, Witch Doctor, there's this scout down here, this scout up here, and this Gunmaster who is currently wounded. Now, so, I think what we will do is buzz little Jade over here. Actually, no, because that, that's going to that's gonna be a bad scene for her. Uh, did I move her over here? I think I might have. Let's see. Didn't have a shot. Don't appear to have a shot on anybody. Oh, that's because I'm 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 sprinting. Of course not. Okay, so if I put her here, I could potentially kill this gunmaster. Um, I could also. Yeah, maybe we'll. Maybe that's what we're gonna do. So this is all going to be a little bit different because I can't obviously re replicate everything I did before. Back to me. Did she oh, just miss Jade. a 99% shot? Wow. That is really unfortunate. Okay, well she's only got 60 hit points and I think these guys do like 60 or 70 per hit. So I think Jade's probably going down next turn. Diggs, well, maybe what we want to do with him this time is use Tackle. Um, can the Witch Doctor... Actually, let's do this. Let's first chuck... Let me scout this out. The... Why is Ambush stuck on the screen? Alright, let's chuck the, the Sapling Cedar over here and hopefully it will grab the witch doctor so that the witch doctor can't can't heal uh, come over here and heal the gunmaster and then we can use tackle nope no we cannot use tackle we are one square out of range to be able to use tackle that's a shame Okay, then what we're gonna do... Uh, I really wish Ambush was not stuck on the screen there. There's another bug. <laughs> we 
running into running into bugs here. Uh, let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Uh, maybe he's got 150 hit points, so he can afford to take a hit. So let's see if we can use the tactical disc and get some bounces. See if we can get a good hit on somebody. Uh, unfortunately, Diggs is going to take a number of hits here, so... I wonder if I want to... Well, I can't really put him anywhere, can I? Yeah, I could. I could put him here. That's behind heavy cover. Probably protect him from this gunmaster over here. Both of these scouts will probably take a shot at him. Okay, good. So he's grabbed. 50 points of damage done to him. Well, that's a shame because the Gunmaster just... just eliminated the Sapling Cedar... or the Sapling immediately. Ooh. Not good. I actually thought this was going to go better. <laughs> Not worse. Okay. Now... I am thinking... We've got to use a tackle on Diggs before he goes down. Because we saw both of those scouts do 50 points of damage. Either one of them can take him out next turn. So we've got to do a tackle... Um, is there a way that I can do a tackle? Here we go. If I do this, then he'll be in cover. And then we can also shoot. Uh, let's see. If we can get the critical hit on on this scout, so 80% chance to hit, 65 to crit. That's I'm I'm pretty. I'm pretty pleased with those odds. Let's try it. Like got him. Okay. Now he's got an extra action point back. We're going to use that to reload the tactical reload. disc. Hopefully we can use that. Uh, what item is this? That's probably a grenade. It's not round enough to be a medipod. Okay. Jade. We need to get rid of this witch doctor. So, I need to reload the ice gun and see if we can get a shot. Maybe what I do is go for the plasma because that could kill him. Okay, so 30 points of damage of health left. He's on fire. He will burn to death on his next turn, so I don't need to worry about him anymore. Now, let's use Elvis. Get him over here. Is there any way we can get this Gunmaster? No. So, we are going instead to come here. 93... That's a dash. That's a dash. Okay, so we're gonna go on this side. Not real thrilled about having him exposed, but... Uh, 130. If I use... Corrosive... 30... 30 additional acid damage over three turns. So, let's see how much we can do right now. Uh, or do I do... Oh, that's Armor Eater. He doesn't have armor. Unnecessary. If we get a lucky critical hit... Oh, sweet! I think we did. Alright, well, he's gonna be a problem. Is he going after Diggs? Oh! Wonderful. Okay. 
He's burning. Darn. Okay. Jade is out. Witch Doctor is dead. Okay, so Gunmaster's got 50. He will take 20 more, so I need to do another 50 points of damage to him. Uh, let's see. Digs. Uh, let's move you first, because that is what gives you your bonus to critical hit. Chance. Alright, there we go. Scout bonus. And now, let's see if we can get a lucky shot with the tactical disc. So this will be a 45%... Oh, you know what I need to do? I need to do... I need to get Elvis over here first and see if... See if we can get an armor eater shot on this guy. Ooh, five percent. That's not. That's not awesome. <laughs> that's not good at all. And he's exposed. Uh, let's see. All right. So maybe I do because he. I don't want this guy acting, so if I can get him over here... 53%, that's not nearly enough. I could toss a grenade. Maybe what I want to do is just get him into cover. Heavy? Is there heavy cover to be had? Could get him all the way over here, but that would leave him exposed to this guy. Okay, what, what if I bring him here? What about this? What if I have di- Oh man, this is tough. Actually, what if I can get the tactical- Get this guy with the tactical disc? I think all the debris is actually blocking him. I think he's in cover. Too good of a cover to get to get him. Yeah, nothing's gonna Nothing's gonna bounce around enough to get him. Okay, that's a shame. Shoot. Okay, so my options are, here's what I'm thinking. Is use digs. Oh man. Two. Throw an energy cell at Elvis. Bam! My man. Now Elvis is good with to use the the glove. So if I get him, can't do it from here. But if I get him over here, now I can use the glove to pick him up. And where can I toss him? It's too bad you can't toss him, like, off the play field to, like, get an instant kill. Uh, so the best I can do is toss him way over here, but Focus. that's going to do... I've got the acid chip attached to that and the fire chip, so that's going to do a lot of extra damage to him. Okay, so he's burning and acid. Now he's doing. Oh boy. Okay, so he's not on fire anymore. Okay. They just did double moves. So now. How are we doing? Digs. You can't tackle yet until next turn. So, let's see if you can use the tactical disc to take out this guy. Oof. Oh, wait. Let's move him first, because that's, that's how he gets his bonus. Actually, I don't even need to use the tactical disc if I get him over here. We can just use a shotgun. Oh, 
That's still not going to do enough damage. Okay, so let's... Yeah, let's, let's use the tactical disc. Alright, so this will be... This will kill him if... Actually, no, let's get the best... Best chance. Come on. Yes! Okay. Awesome. So from here... Uh, I guess the only thing we can do is reload with him. With the disc. Alright, Elvis. Uh, this guy... He's gonna lose another armor, his last armor, next turn. So really what I need, just need to do is get this guy... Let's see, if we put him... Oh, that's a dash. I kinda wanna run him, just sprint him as far away as possible. Actually, is that a Medipod? If I can sprint Elvis as far away as possible... ...and force the guy to come to me... Not gonna be able to pick that thing up, though. Uh, anything in my pack that I can use? Glass bottle, frag grenade, and the knocker. Uh, the knocker might work. Is there a way that I can direct where they go? Oh, that'll that'll send him right here. If I do this, that'll put him over here. Doesn't do damage to him, unfortunately. Yeah, I don't think I want to use that. That would be good to, like, knock somebody off a, a building. Alright. 65% chance to hit. That's just not good enough. Do I want to do this armor eater now? No, I don't need to, because he's going to lose that armor next turn. Oh boy, this is just so tense, you guys. And I want him to be behind heavy cover, so if I run him back to here... If I do this, and then use Overwatch... Because I feel like this dude's going to move. There we go. Put it on both sides so we can get him regardless of which side he could, he runs to. Okay. Loss of armor. 50 points of damage. Get him. Get him. Get him. Oh! 10 hit points left. Okay. Diggs. Need you to move. And then, how do we want to do this? Ha! Ac accidental Matt Mercer there. Alright. Boom. Okay, everybody. Combat is over. We have survived the ambush. Now, let's see if I spin the camera around. Am I going to see the little triangle, or the little diamond, over Joseph? And can I talk to him? Or is my game just broken and I can no longer continue? I don't see it on the compass. Quests. Under threat. Speak to Joseph. This is Joseph. Fuck!
Thank you.